Hey Leute, willkommen zurück zu Danganronpa 2. Goodbye, das wäre immer noch im Class Trial und diesmal auch wieder alleine. Äh, wir haben ihn, glaube ich, endlich herausgefunden. Seems there are no dangerous items like that skewer and a churrasco earlier inside that pile of food. That appears to be the case. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have known what to do if he said fish bones and meat bones were also dangerous items. But in fact, the only place you could hide the weapon was inside the food that couldn't be inspected. Out of all the dishes you prepare, the only one that could hide a weapon as long as an iron skewer is the meat on the bone. What now? I'm using my right to remain silent. There's no way that exists here. We need to confirm this now. So if we eat that tasty looking piece of meat and find the iron skewer inside, bullseye! All right. Monokuma or Monami, one of you hurry and bring over that piece of meat. One minute. Just give me one minute. I'll eat the whole thing! Wait, now hold on a second. Time out, time out! What are you doing? Hurry up and bring it over! Uh, about that. Uh. Huh? Where did Monokuma go? I'm right here! Uh. I'm already eating it! Uh, a bear that eats meat! Uh, wait, now that I think about it, that's pretty normal. Oh, no. oh, what is this? So yummy! Damn it! That's my meat! I've never eaten anything like it in my entire life! The taste brings me back to my days in the wild. This, this is bad! Seriously, this is really bad! My, my! There's something inside the meat! Look what came out! Mm. Isn't that... Is that an iron skewer? Check it out. The handle looks like it's made of bone. Pretty clever. The sword of destruction, encased in bone and sheathed in meat. It brought catastrophe unto Byakuya. As expected of Teru Teru. Such a fantastic weapon from the ultimate chef. You're wrong. I'm not the killer. I'm not the kind of person who would kill someone. I got it. You all set me up. You guys set me up so you can blame this on me. Jeez, what a disappointment. Such an unseemly defense for an ultimate like you. Can you really call that hope? Hey, Nagito. I'm sorry, but can you just be quiet? Gisa, you're all nothing but a bunch of poor loud mouth fast food eating hicks. You, you don't need to translate anymore. Somehow I can tell what he's trying to say. Let's just deal with Nagito later. More importantly, we should first. I guess we need to settle this. Once and for all. Oh, that's comic, right? To do that, we need to go over yeah. the entire incident from beginning to end and make everything clear. Go over the entire incident, and then I can prove Terra Terra's crime. That's right, if we don't do that, we can't end this no matter how much time passes. So, we need, we need to, to do it. At least that's ever. So let's finally come to this. My job is stressing every case has one last feature to begin to bring the class trial to an end. This is the closing argument. Okay, if it's in this phase, you'll give a complete summary of the case. You'll have to reproduce the order of events of the case in the form of a comic book. This reproduces merely Hachima's imagination, so there will be gaps here and there. Gaps are areas where a number of pieces are missing. It's up to you to complete the comic using the proof panels provided. Around three to five proof panels make up one set. Inside that one set, there will be correct panels placed among incorrect panels. If you use up all of the correct panels contained in one set, it will switch to a new set. After that, if you fill in all the holes, you will clear the challenge. I'm pretty sure some of you already know this, but it will be difficult to complete with so many gaps. But once you fill some in, it will become much simpler. 
for those of you who played the previous game, you might hesitate at first, but it's basically the same concept. Now that we've been playing and solving the closing argument, there's a certain trick. If you move the reticle into the gaps on each page, it will display hints at the top of the screen. Ah, so okay. This type of hint will ask what kind of scene is draw drawn in, the in that gap. Also, if you move the reticle into a tr onto a truth panel, it will display a hint as well. This hint explains the scene contained in that panel. Put together these two hints and think carefully. Of course, don't forget that there will be a time limit. Well, then good luck and have fun. Scheint einfacher zu sein sogar, als im ersten. Kann man anscheinend Hinweise bekommt. Everyone at the party is. Eating even during the blackout, das Tätsel wird nicht sein. Big Meat on the Bone. Was haben wir hier oben noch schon, ne? Everyone at the party is. At the storage room before the blackout. It's not even. Gott verdammt! Ernsthaft? Für welches ist es wohl? Was? Ach so! Oh, ich hab's falsch verstanden! Oh man! Man kann die überall einsetzen! Man muss nicht mit dem ersten anfangen. It's no use, I can't go any longer. I don't have any other options. And that helps me. Increase the trials, come to an end. And it's time to vote. Nein. Warum wählen die dann vor allem mich? Es gibt so viele Beweise, dass er es war. Warum wählen die dann trotzdem nicht? Nein. Ja, natürlich will ich retryen. We will never give up! Okay, probieren wir es jetzt nochmal. Wir müssen... Ich, okay, ich hab's jetzt verstanden, wie es funktioniert. Und muss einfach mal das ganze Ding durchgucken. Also... Hä? Und jetzt sind hier schon wieder andere Sachen. A knife glowing in the dark. Ja, das wird aber während dem Blackout sein. Jackie's guarding the old... Buildings entrance. Okay, huch. Keine Ahnung. Das ist jetzt schwierig. Aber hier ist es. In the office room when the blackout occurred. Okay, hier wird nichts davon sein. Who did Byakuya see? The moment it got dark, Byakuya... Hilfe! Gott, ist das schrecklich. Hat die Office Room in the Black Eye Curd hier? Same scene as the Office Room in Dining Hall. Das dauert schon der Vorder Black Eye. Ah, das ist übel. What did the killer obtain at the storage room? Tablecloth. Oh, das ist ja jetzt nirgendwo. Yaki is guarding the old building's entrance. Put me on the bone. Unlit portable stove. Knife going in the dark. I kind of keep eating during the blackout. Hey, ist das scheiße. Warte! Ah! Okay. I heard it. Das was gehört. Ja. 
Was? Okay. Ich meine, ich hab was wieder. Who did Biakia see Nagito? Hat er gesehen. Und hier ist es. Der Moment, der got dark. Biakia. Hat das Ding angemacht. Was? Ey, es ist furchtbar, echt. Ah, warte. I heard it war doch ganz am Ende, ne? Oder? I heard it. Perfect. Nikomar is holding it in. Must hold it. I saw. And pistol that has a case containing potential weapons. The air con. Ach, das ist nicht die Box. Das ist der air conditioner. Das habe ich jetzt falsch verpasst. Das habe ich jetzt falsch. Okay. Was ist hier? Die Gotti Killer obtain. What did the killer obtain at the storage room? Okay, after exiting into that dark hall, they'll obtain the light. It's all from storage room, it's kind of nice to be able to Noch ja, das hier wird wahrscheinlich wichtig sein. Set at 11.30. Das ist halt jetzt die große Frage, wo kommt das? Das Oh, ist das schlimm, ey. Ach, warte, hier vielleicht? Ja. Last stock. Okay. Hier rein. So haben wir noch switched on. Killer used to mark to use the mark to move under the floorboards. The irons turn on. Uh, haben wir hier alles so nein, haben wir nicht alles. Let the storm from the floor. Okay. Hier vorne haben wir alles. Okay, das hier wird wahrscheinlich nicht wichtig sein, aber das hier. Und das wird wahrscheinlich dann ganz am Ende irgendwo sein. The killer obtained a light. Here's everything that happened in this case. Oh, okay, doch nicht. Let's try going over the whole incident, beginning with right after the party started. Yakia had us gather in the dining hall of the old building near the hotel. He was extra cautious about a murder occurring that night because of a threatening letter he received. Therefore, he decided to throw a party so he could monitor us. The one, the one person, person didn't, didn't come. come. The, the rest, rest of us assembled at the dining hall, and, and the party was underway. Was underway. But at, at that, that time, time, the trap set, set by a certain someone was already in motion. motion. They, they plugged three, three irons, irons into the outlets, outlets in the storage room, which, which nearly kept the power usage. usage. Additionally, Additionally, they prepared, they prepared something, something else that would activate at 11.30 p.m. The air conditioners in the office and dining hall. They had already set the timers for these. Thanks to the irons maxing out the power usage, the breaker was tripped when the air conditioners kicked on. Since the windows in the old building were covered, the blackout plunged the dining hall into total darkness. But when that happened, Biakia took out a specific item that he brought in his case. That, that item was, was the night vision goggles. Biakia was so concerned about a murder occurring that he brought a variety of security equipment with him. When he put on his night vision goggles, 
Byakuya witnessed a certain someone making a suspicious move. He saw Nagito guiding himself with the desk lamp's power cord so he could get under the table. That's right, everything up to that point was all part of Nagito's plan. The murder warning to Byakuya, the source of the blackout, it was all Nagito. While the blackout was happening, someone else, the real killer, began making their move in the kitchen. The killer probably already knew about Nagito's plan, so they knew a blackout was coming. That's why the killer prepared all the items they would need to commit their crime in the dark beforehand. They needed a light source, which was provided by the portable stove in the kitchen. They needed a weapon, too. This had also been hidden in the kitchen beforehand. The long iron skewer used in the churrasco dish. The killer hid that inside that meat with the bone in it. With the weapon and portable stove in hand, the killer stepped out into the hallway. First, they closed the fire door in the hallway so their light source wouldn't peek toward the dining hall. Then, guided by the light, the killer headed toward the storage room and grabbed a specific item. That's right, a tablecloth to block the blood splatter. With this, the killer finished their preparations and snuck under the floorboards through the secret passage. They probably turned off the portable cooking stove at that point, or left it near the entrance of the door. The floor in the dining hall is full of gaps, so there's no way they could have safely held a light source. But thanks to the glowing mark they painted earlier, the killer was able to get beneath the table. Under the table, Byakuya found the knife that had been hidden there. If only he had retreated, he probably wouldn't have gotten killed. He had to retrieve that knife. And at that moment... The killer lurking beneath the floorboard stabbed straight up with the iron skewer. The killer had been waiting in the dark for the moment when the glowing paint began to move. After they murdered Byakuya, the killer purposefully shouted from beneath the floorboards to make it seem like they were still in the dining hall. Afterward, they came out from underneath the floorboards and rushed back to the kitchen. And then, after hiding the murder weapon in the kitchen, they rejoined the group as if nothing had happened. There's only one person who would have been able to commit this crime. Especially if that person is someone who'd think of an unexpected way to hide a weapon inside food. Isn't that right, Teru Teru Hanamura? That's what happened. How about it? Did I get anything wrong? This is a mistake. A mistake, a mistake, I tell, I tell you, you, I would, I would never, never, I would never kill anyone. Would never. <laughs> it seems this is the end. <laughs> Ja, ich habe mich doof angestellt in dem, aber das war auch einfach so komisch, weil alles irgendwie anders war. Also so viele Sachen sind halt anders im ersten Teil und ich dachte halt, ja, egal. <lacht> It looks like your argument has come to a close. Oops, I lost control of my wild side for a second. Was that a side effect of the meat I just ate? Well, putting that aside, let's move along to the nerve-wracking voting time. 
Now then, please pull the lever in front of you and cast your vote. Oh, just a reminder, make triple sure you vote for someone. If you don't vote, I'm gonna eat you up just like that meat from earlier. <laughs> Why did this happen? Who will be chosen as the blackened? Will you make the right choice or the dreadfully wrong one? <laughs> Such heart pounding excitement! Correct! That's right, this time the black and responsible for killing Byaku Yatugami is Teru Teru Hanamura. No, 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 it was a mistake. I'm telling you, it was just a mistake. I was only trying to save you guys. Hey! I was only trying to stop Nakita from murdering one of you. Das glaube ich ihm sogar. Das kann ich ihm sogar nicht irgendwie glauben. Huh? Trying to stop? What do you mean? Aber woher wusste er das? Er wusste es wahrscheinlich gar nicht. I, I spent all morning in the old building preparing the dishes for the party and then... I heard a weird laughter near the dining hall and when I peeked over there... I saw him. I saw Nagito in the middle of cleaning duty putting the knife under the table. I had a bad feeling about it so I continued to watch what he was doing. And I saw him place the iron seat brought, brought in the storage room and mess with the air conditioner timers. Plus he was grinning, just grinning by himself the whole time. So I questioned him. When that happened, he... You, you caught, caught me? me? Oh, I've been caught. W what? B been caught? Hey! What are you doing? What are you scheming? <laughs> I'm planning to kill someone, of course. <laughs> Terror Terror, just to let you know, it's pointless of you to stop me. If you stop me now, it doesn't matter. I will never give up. Whether it's tomorrow, the day after tomorrow, or the days beyond that, I'll definitely start the killing. Impossible! What? No matter how much you want to leave this island, that's just... I see, so that's what you think. Well... But that's not at all. This isn't about my survival. I just want the killing to start. What? What are you saying? <laughs> I love everyone here, that's why I want to be, to be of good use to them. I love all of the ultimates and I marry them for being symbols of hope. Amazing! That's right. In the name of hope, I love everyone's talents from the bottom of my heart. That's why <laughs> I want him to lose against someone like killing, something like killing. I want him to prove to me that hope will never lose, no matter how daunting the despair they face may seem. <laughs> I want everyone to prove to prove to me that hope will never lose to despair. No, 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 no. What are you saying? I don't understand at all. See? Isn't it typical that if you face a that if you face a strong enemy, you will become even stronger yourself? Which means the stronger the despair you face, the stronger everyone's hope will become, I... right? I want to see that brightness, and in order to see it, I'm going to become everybody's stepping stone. I want to make your hope shine. It's as simple as that. <laughs> That's right. I yearn for a powerful hope that I can overcome any kind of despair. Right? Don't tell me you're actually serious. Man. So you don't understand. That's fine. I don't really mind. <laughs> I'm just an obsessed fanboy, so it's alright that this love of mine is unrequited. I suppose I can be called the ultimate, the ultimate, ultimate fanatic. No way, no way, no way! You, th there's something wrong with you. <laughs> really? Do you really think so? Do you really think there's something wrong with me? Hey. But isn't that what love is? 
gut, Leute. Dann würde ich sagen, machen wir hier im nächsten Part weiter bei Dengan Romper 2. Goodbye, Despair und ciao.